So a lot of you have been asking for a little uh, chicken update. Um, we got to winterize the coop right now. Being out remote here, I had to think uh, outside the box and I'm gonna get a solar panel installed so I can run a solar lamp. And as you can hear there, we don't have all chickens. We ended up with two roosters. So let's go take a look at them. <laughs> no eggs yet either, the dang freeloaders. Yeah, hi guys. There's our roosters. We got two roosters and honestly, unfortunately they're probably gonna have to go. It'll make it a lot easier this winter to maintain four. Um, we'll have to see. I might have a change of heart because they're two of my favorites. But yeah, here's the chickens. So what I'm gonna do now, here's the little idea for everything. I'm going to take some like uh, spray foam filler and spray in all these cracks. I'm going to cut out a piece and then throw some um, window in for light in the winter and then rig up a so solar panel here off the roof to get them a uh, heat lamp and um, water for, to keep their water from freezing. So yeah, they're a lot of work. They've been good. And we'll double check. Yeah, no eggs yet. That really should be right around the corner, so we'll see. You're doing a pretty good job sealing in the chickens from critters. I don't know what kind of poop this is, if it's a raccoon poop or something like that, but something's been checking them out and can't get in. Kind of lost its rustic appeal, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do to keep the chickens warm in the winter. Now we're going to shoot some other chickens. You gonna help us with the chicken coop today, Harper? Come on, Harper. Oh, good job. You pussy the chicken. Can you smell them? Come on. I think the roosters might attack you. I'm not even going to let them out. Until I dispatch them. What is that? Did you, did you hear that? Go get them. <laughs> what is that, Harper? Yep, we're going to get them all situated for winter today. Aren't we, girl? Other bolts. Do you have another bolt? I don't. Because then you'd be able to fit one in there, right? Mm hmm. And then. Not yet, I'm working on just... Can you push on right there? Yep. Sorry. No, you're good. Oh, oh, no. So Tap and I got the solar hookup for these off-grid chickens here. Um, we're running into the problem, obviously, if you look here. It's the time of the year where 
stuff starting to freeze. So to fix the problem, we set up a little solar panel, ran it across and quickly made a little box for it. If you look in here, we have it run to a little 12 volt, which then runs into uh, a little adapter here and a plug-in. And uh, that should keep the water um, from freezing throughout the winter. Because if you quickly come in here, you can see we got a little heated water for these guys. So the next thing is we're going to want to seal up all these walls, keep the heat in for them, but slowly and surely getting this all ready for them to go. Thanks for watching. So this is what the coop looks like right now. I, uh, we used four cans of spray foam and we got mostly all the way around the top sections of the coop with heat rising at all. I wanted to start there with what I have. And I think as it gets colder and the more and more I come up for these guys, I'm just gonna keep bringing more and more cans of spray foam until we get it all foamed up. But it's a good thing they got water now. That's a headache done. Coming along. Come on, cutie.